Today we are in Sanford and in front of us, Bahama Breeze. Now we did a video at Bahama Breeze like two years ago. So this is gonna be, what do we call it? The refresh review of Bahama Breeze. And we also have a gift card, so why not use that? Um, we like Bahama Breeze, but it has been probably a year maybe since longer than that, longer than that since we have actually gone and eaten at one. So it, it might have been the video that we filmed was the last time we've been to one. So looking forward to going back and eating some good food. Let's go check it out. Now they do have plenty of outdoor seating as well as an outdoor bar connected to the indoor bar. I think we'll be inside today as it's a warm one. I also got this little like area here for outdoor seating as well. We gotta go to the front because that's where you will see the hostess to be seated. But this little area also has a little fire pit which is not needed today. Now as far as location goes, uh, Red Robin's right there, Cheddar's is there, and I believe the Andes we filmed at is just that way, yonder. Bahama Breeze Island Grill. Nice little seating here out front. Hours are hard to see, but it says Sunday through Thursday, 11 to 11, Friday and Saturday at 11 to midnight. Happy hour, Monday through Friday, 4 to 6. And late night, happy hour, Sunday through Thursday, 9 p.m. to close. And this is what it looks like in here. So we have the bar here that's connected to the outside bar. Restrooms are in the far end, men on the left, women on the right. And ceiling fans that remind me of Cheddar's. Cheddar's has those kind of ceiling fans. And then we're gonna walk this way. Feels good in here. And we're gonna be back over here. Got one of those screens. All right, let's take a look at the menu. So if we open up, we've got the spirits of the islands. Taste of the tropics, frozen. They've got margaritas, mojitos, flights to paradise, and sangrias. I do like how they have prices on all those. And then over here, ice cold beer, wines, 0% alcohol, 100% island. And there's some fresh brewed iced tea. We just started with some waters because I didn't know what I'm gonna get to drink yet. There's desserts and the kids menu. Now, if we open it up, we have get the party started. What'd you say we need to get? Oh yeah. Why does it say they're new? We've had them before. Maybe they've like, changed up how they are i don't know whole jamaican jerk wings Ooh. island pasta and if we finish the pasta side and seafood side come over to the mainland jerk chicken pineapple bowl we've gotten that before right it's i think so jerk chicken pineapple bowl I don't remember what we did in our video either, but... Oh, did we? There's salads, handhelds, soup and salads, and I think that's the full menu. I might get a drink, but I don't know what to get to eat yet or what to drink, so I'm gonna look at the menu. Since we have a gift card, we might as well get the margarita flight, so we're gonna share the margarita flight. We ordered the cheese sticks, and not sure what we're gonna get to eat yet. I'm kind of torn between the Jamaican jerk wings. I do like trying ribs at places. They've got guava barbecue sauce. Or even the Jamaican jerk chicken, which is also really tasty as well. So here are the yuca cheese sticks. There's a lot of them, that looks good. All right, what are you doing? I'm going to try the paella. Ooh, we've never tried that here, have we? Not here. I think I'm gonna do the jerk wings. You can have some of mine too. Yeah, we can share. Let's give one of these a try. I don't know what the sauces are. So you think they're like last time? Yeah. What's the, is that like a, it's like a Southwest some sort of, this one? yeah. That one said something about sriracha, but I don't know. Oh, um, and then what's this one? I have no clue. Uh, we don't know. If I have to choose between a sauce I like better, I like that sauce. What about you? That one? Just looking at all the uh, different Darden restaurants on this gift card, 
We've done an Olive Garden review, a Cheddar's review, Bahama Breeze. I don't think I've ever been to the Yard House, have you? A uh, Longhorn Steakhouse I've been to, but haven't done a review at. And then Seasons 52 I've never been to. So there's still a couple, I guess three, technically three other garden restaurants that we haven't done reviews at. Here's a look at that margarita flight. And what do we've got? Classic dragon fruit and coconut pineapple. Let's try the classic first. It's a good classic margarita, a little strong. Glad they're small. Dragon fruit. Oh, that one's really good. And then coconut pineapple. Oh, I might choose the coconut pineapple. That tastes like, kind of like a pina colada. All those are very good. Which one did you like the best? Classic. You like the classic? That's my brand. That didn't take long at all. Here's the paella. Looks really good. And then here are the wings. Those are big, huge wings. Let's dig in. These are like actual hot, very hot. Actual massive wings. I don't even know how to really eat these. Nah, they're too hot to eat right now. All right, gonna attempt to try this. With some ranch. I guess that's jerk barbecue. Here we go. Now now pulling them apart works better. Still very hot, but those are good. Um, I'm glad I got ranch with the jerk because it's a little spicy, not bad. I'm getting pretty full because these are big. What I've noticed the easiest way to eat them is pull them apart. And since they're still very hot, use your fork to kind of pick off the chicken. And the jerk sauce is pretty spicy. Now I am gonna try some of Timber's shrimp, scallops, and mussels. Here's the scallop, pretty good size. Ah, uh, so-so. I've had better scallops, I've had worse scallops. Let's try the shrimp. That's pretty good shrimp. Now the mussel. Not bad. A good feature about this uh, screen thing is you can see what the desserts look like. There's the chocolate island. You want that one, you think? Yeah. There's the pineapple cheesecake empanadas and then the key lime. We ended up going with the chocolate island and look at this. There's no way we can eat all that, that's huge. It looks very good though. All right, let's give this a try. That is rich. That is good. Very rich, good. Here's just a look at what it looks like on the inside. No way I can, are we finishing this? Ooh. And then the good news about these little screens is you can pay at the table. So it looks like our total is $73.78. Now again, I said we had a gift card, so it really won't be that expensive at all. But normally, if we didn't have a gift card, we'd be sharing an entree and probably not getting a drink. All right, now we're gonna head back outside, stuffed, big time. Ooh, are you full? I'm very full. All right, that was our refresh review at Bahama Breeze. I'm stuffed. Tired. I have to say, oh, I got something in my eyeball. I have to say that next time I probably wouldn't get the wings because too much work. Definitely too much work. Um, and they were whew, very, very warm. Um, I think I would stick with that uh, jerk chicken bowl, the pineapple yeah, chicken bowl. Yeah, that's kind of the go-to. Or the shrimp one. I've also had the tacos, the fish tacos, oh, yeah. and they were good as well. And but the salmon was good we had. Yeah, but overall, I think those were good. We probably would just choose the go-to ones like we've gotten before. So that gives you another review of Bahama Breeze. Dessert, the dessert, very good. With that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.